Have you thought about doing a map animation in your travel video, or in any other videos, from Filmora? Well, you clicked the right video. In this step-by-step -step tutorial, I'm gonna be showing you how to make a map animation video, inside Filmora X. This video is going to be interesting to your travel videos, to show what is the location that you went, in your travel. So let's get started. Oh! Before getting started, you gonna have to need a photo of a map, and, a photo of a map pointer. And if you wanna use the photos that I used, the links are in the description. You can use them to practice along. Now I have those things imported to Filmora, so let's bring the map to the first track, of the timeline. Double click on the map, and go to video. In there, scale the map a little and click OK. Now bring the photo of the map pointer, to the top of the map. Now, trim the video, so that it matches the time. Place your playhead at the beginning of the second video. Then double click on it. Go to animation, and make sure you are in the customize tab. Now, we are going to add keyframes. First you have to place the map pointer to your country, or, destination. Now, scale the image all the way to 0%. Then go few frames forward. And scale the image to 100%. Oh, sorry. I mean, 20%. Then go one frame forward, by clicking the right arrow on your keyboard. Then scale it to 15%. Again go one frame forward, and scale it to 20%. Do this scaling process a couple of time, until you get a bounce effect like this. And click OK. Now what I will do is, Render my video. When it's done, play it back to see the result. Then, go to the time, where you want to finish the animation, and double click on the video. Then in the animation, add a keyframe. Then, go 3 or 2 frames forward on your timeline and set the scale to 27.2%, or, any number you want to use. Now go 2 frames forward, and set the scale to 0%. Click OK. Now, as always, you can do a playback to see the end result that we've got. I'm gonna render my video again. Because it's good thing that you are rendering the video, after you add those animations, transitions, titles, etc. When it's done, go to your titles. Then scroll down. Until you find this title, which is named as Call Out 2. Then drag it to the top of the timeline. Now, go back to media. Place your playhead, at the point where the title starts. And double click on it. And go to video. Now you can use the X and Y sliders, to reposition the title. And also, scale it down a little. Now you can just type whatever you want. I mean, the location, and the date. and click OK. Then, trim the title to the end. And render your video. As I told you before, it's always good. 
Now do a playback, to see the result. As you can see, the title do not do anything at the end. So, for that, go to Transitions. Find the Dissolve Transition. And apply it to the end of the title. Make it faster, by trimming the transition. And... Bada bim, bada boom! It's done! Now, there's a one thing that you can do to really sell this effect. You can add sound effects. I have these two sounds, that you can use from the link in the description. If you add those for the correct position, and do some trimming and fading, you will get something like this. And that's it. Now I will end this video, giving you some knowledge of editing in Filmora 10. Then I hope, I will see you in my next video. Have a nice day.